Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Brothers and sisters, this is a very personal message from my heart because it directly affects my family. Um, in this case, my younger sister. Now, she's been a human rights campaigner for decades, working around the clock for the most abused, the most oppressed people on earth. And for nearly 20 years of that, working with Amnesty International. Now, recently they took a strange stance. They decided to support a far-right nationalist, somebody who'd stood with neo-Nazis. Now, this guy did a video where he showed a picture of Chechens. He called them cockroaches. And then he got an actor to dress up like a Muslim, looking like a Muslim, and shot him. He said, this is the way to deal with these people. My sister said, this is blatant Islamophobia and you must withdraw it. Now, they refused. My sister refused to back down. They gaslit her and they sacked her for her stance. And she's suing them for Islamophobia. Now, this is not about you or my sister or me as individuals. This is about us as a community standing up to institutionalize Islamophobia and racism and saying we will not accept this. Now, her court case is in two weeks. As a family, we've raised £30,000 to support her and we need to raise another twenty. Now, this is how much justice costs these days and we need your help. Again, it's not about you or me. This is about us as a community. This is a landmark case. And if she wins, inshallah, this will affect every single Muslim in the workplace, sending out a clear message that institutions cannot be blatantly Islamophobic. You cannot treat one community one way and then treat Muslims in another way. We've had enough. So please help us in this campaign for us, for a community, for justice, for Muslims in the workplace and give whatever you can. We need your du'as and whatever you can donate.